everybody, Jen here. Um, just doing a quick um, unboxing my October, uh, uh, what's in my October box, uh, ER box, uh, uh, wellness box. Sorry, it's been really crazy, so I'm kind of all over the place here. But I wanted to get on here and, and do this so that you guys would do it. Because you'd be like, where's the October one? It's already, you know, not October anymore. And granted, it's a little late because I had to move it to the end of the month. Uh, due to different kind of financial uh, things that cropped up throughout the month. So, um, and I'll explain that in a little bit. But basically, excuse me one minute. Let me get my water. Oh, so much better. Um, so basically what's been going on is there's been a lot of stuff going on. So I had to, um, because of this whole shutdown thing, um, and things that I couldn't do when I needed to do them, I had to do them now because we're starting to get like at full blown open again. So I had to spend finances on my car and get my car all settled. So I wasn't able to put it back into what I wanted to, which was my young living order. Um, it is what happens. This is the cool thing about Young Living. You are able to actually do whatever you want and maneuver it around so that you can do it. Luckily, I don't really necessarily have a lot of people on my team right now. And a lot of people are struggling too. So I didn't need the top tier of 100 versus 50. Um, so it's no sweat off my back. And I still got the product that I needed. Um, or the products. So basically what I did this month is I ended up just going uh, least is more, you know, less is more type of a thing. Because I've actually got a ton of stock myself and I've been using the other stuff, but there was one item that I was completely out of and I was having a hard time and I needed it for uh, nighttime. So basically... Um, and don't mind this, we just had snow yesterday, um, so all this and the heat in the house is starting to activate up again, so I need to do my LLP, um, for this, which is my lemon, lav lavender, and peppermint. I have to get that back out and put it in my diffuser and start diffusing that, and then put my, um, uh, RC and, uh, breathe again and other stuff on. But right now, um, if I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna make sure it's underneath, so, because they got lemon in them, and lemon is photosensitive, so I just gotta make sure that the sun's not gonna hit my skin where I put that on. Or else it'll, it'll cause a little, um, reddening, is all. So anyways, um, cause it's photosensitive, so the sun being on your skin will cause a, the constituents in the oil to think that it's an actual plant and needs to photosynthesize, which is funny. So I'm like, I'm a plant. When that happens, I go, oh, look, I'm turning around. I'm a plant. It thinks I'm a plant. Yay. But anyways. And we have no humidifiers downstairs. Um, so I'm trying to bring a diffuser downstairs and have it going, but then trying to find uh, spots to plug it in where the animals are not going to knock it over. It's just so much fun. <laughs> so anyway, so I did my order. I had it for the end of the month. Um... And it got here three days ago, but I've been so busy doing stuff with my work and trying to get stuff settled here and all this other stuff that I never got around to doing it. Um, so I just opened it and um, of course you get the, the essential edge. Now they've changed this a little bit, so it's now a quarterly thing. So I'll talk about this on the end um, for those people that just want to know what I got first. Um, and then you get that and then you get your items and then of course your invoice. So basically... What I got in this one was something that I've been needing for the last uh, month, I guess, which I've been kind of like, nah, you know, because I had financial things where I had to use it all for my car, and then I didn't have it here, have it there, so then I had to kind of move things around. And then I finally was able to actually get it, which is amazing. And I use this for nighttime at all times when I'm sleeping, right before sleeping, it helps me calm down um, also when I'm out dealing with other things like uh, ma mask wearing, things like that. It's also one of the ones in my Calm uh, CBD roll-on that I got for the uh, through Nature's Ultra that we partner. And it's, it's overall very good for skin, um, this oil and this product. So um, none other than, of course, our very old lavender essential oil. 
all right? So here's your lavender essential oil. I love this stuff so much. I had a stockpile a while back and I went through my stockpile now, so I just had to order more. And it's just like, oh my gosh. It's like a field of lavender. Now, granted, this side of my nostril is almost completely plugged. That's why I have issues when I put on a mask. Because I've got like 95% closure over here. And not to mention all the other crap going on. So that's why I have issues. So this also helps me. And I put a couple drops in my mask, which I haven't been able to. Um, and then I put my mask on. But I have a couple other different masks. And um, the ones that work, I'm working with the people at work, kind of. So, But I'm also learning to be, uh, they call it emotion, no. Lovingly detached. So I don't, like, get overly emotional and start getting upset on things that I can't really control. Um, so I've also learned with a lot of using the oils and doing all this stuff, too, that um, I can just let things go. Like, you can't control the situations. Whatever happens, happens. You can be proactive about it and, like, start, like, say, if you... They're talking about maybe letting you go at your job. You can start being like, oh, okay, well, I need to start searching for another one. So you can do that stuff, because that's kind of like where I was finding myself. And then now all of a sudden, no talk. And then now there's now talk again of lowering the hours because it's slow season. So I'm like, I'm not going to sit there and get all upset about, oh, well, I have to pay my discover and I have to make sure what this income's coming in and all this stuff. Because that just takes away from, you know, your experience. So what I'm doing right now is I'm thank goodness for this again using this at night because I've been it helps me sleep like so much like I get a better quality of sleep when I use this at night like nobody's business um and mind you I just looked on um google and they have things on amazon for this like and that's a no-no do not and I say underline do not trust Anything that's sold on Amazon, I'm telling you this now, you cannot guarantee that it's 100% safe for you. They can open it up, put another cap on, and do it. It's not cool, guys. Don't fall for that shit, okay? Um, technically, I was going to report all the people that were doing it, because that's illegal. You're not allowed to do that through Young Living's quality control. I mean, and that's where people get, like, stupid because they're like, Oh, well, I don't have enough money, so I'm going to sell in here and upsell it, which is not good to the customer. So guys, don't go cheap out. Don't I, I get it if you can't have the money, that's fine. Just don't go and try to get something that you think is quality from a subpar part. And this hits really home for me, okay? This is this is really like not cool, guys. If you want the quality, go straight to the source. Don't go to some third party crap out, okay? Um Young Living is actually breaking down on those and uh they have a whole legal department so if people are selling on amazon or something they are compiling cases against them um and all this stuff so it's it's like kind of like a behind the scenes thing but i i do know that they are um it's part of the compliance thing and especially with the fda cracking down and all this stuff so if you even have a thinking of even doing that or selling uh, like that stuff on there if you're a um entrepreneur and you you're like teaming up with young living or i've even seen doTERRA i've seen other people too from other companies mlms document you're not supposed to do that it's against mlm policy um usually most mlms have that as a general in their uh, procedures and policies anyways but um just telling you you cannot trust that kind of stuff i know people are trying to like like okay so case in point soji i got this bottle water bottle i don't know soji from a friend of mine who was selling them. She bought them from the person and then resold them, but she resold them at legit their price. Like, so she bought them at their price and she sold them uh, for maybe one or two dollars more or something like that. Not, not, or I don't know how she did, but she basically sold them for what they are. Basically saying that that's Soji, she got them from the Soji website. She did, she was honest about it all. She goes, oh no, if you don't want to buy them here because they're the same price, you can go online and get them online. That's why she didn't get a lot of people. Then you get these people that had this, took off this icon here, and sold the exact same bottle for 
cheap, but for more, so they're getting more profit. So the company itself had to change their tops because this is an old one. If you get a new one, it's got like a metal thing here because basically nobody can make that or cheap it off. So they had to do something so that they could stop selling these and end up changing it. Now the core, the crystal, unfortunately in the middle of them now, the new ones are thinner than this. So I'm glad I got the old one, but it, it, it tells you people are cheaping out. People want so much money because they don't want to actually do some of the work, unfortunately. And there are people out there that will freaking bamboozle you. And I don't want people to be able to get bamboozled. So word to the wise, do not buy stuff like this that you know is from another third party website. Go directly to the original website if you can, because that's where you can trust the actual company is legit. No, I don't trust anything else. There's too many scammers. There's too many people out there. And then you can say, oh, well, I bought a Young Living Lavender and it gave me heart, um, this or that or whatever issues. Um, and it burned me or something. It's because it wasn't actually ours. It was from a third party. And after it leaves Young Living's thing and it goes to the individual or wherever, they are not liable for it. So if you go and you buy something on Amazon and then you get hurt from it, you cannot sue them because it was you who bought it from a third party and not the actual website. So please, if you want safety, if you want stuff, get it from the source, guys. Don't be cheaping out. If you want cheaper oils, that's fine. You can go and buy cheap oils at, say, your dollar store, your health store, or whatever. But don't go and try to think that you're going to get the best product with the name and everything when you're buying it from a cheap price or a cheap store. Okay, it just, use your brain. Come on, guys. I mean, I'm sorry. This is, like, common sense here. Uh, you get what you pay for. I mean, I seriously, you get what you pay for. All right, anyways, I digress. Ooh, okay. I'm sorry. It just really pisses me off. These people who want to scam people. I'm like, I, I hate when people get scammed because it hurts me, you know? And I'm like, mm because I've been scammed myself and I'm like excuse me mm -mm. and then you can't go after the person because then they they're on to a next person it's like all these spam phone calls and stuff so I want to end all that don't do it don't do it <laughs> all right so anyways um that's what I got I got the lavender essential oil and I love it because um depending on where the batch is which you can actually look up on the website too the young living website there's a little thing that shows you uh, where the batches are coming coming from Basically, um, you can see whether it's from our, um, I think it's Idaho farm in Lavender or if it's from the France one, in, the farm in France, um, because each one is slightly different. Hence why you can't duplicate the smell necessarily. And that's why, you know, it's an actual legit plant and not like a duplicated fragrance like some of these other companies like to get away with. Um, and that's why each constituent is different. You can go on and see the chart of what the constituents are inside each batch of the oil and stuff. It's really cool if you're into science and stuff like that. It's really awesome. Um, and the company is extremely transparent, so it's really cool. I mean, to be honest, we just had our holiday launch, and the holiday launch with so many people wanting to get on because we just had a um, competition for Bora Bora, and a bunch of people joined up through that whole entire competition for the last, like, three to six months um so then all of a sudden there's this overload on the website and it crashed so young living has decided that they're gonna make sure that they are never gonna have an issue like that again so they're pulling all the people in all the departments and focusing on tech issues and getting the website back up because we got a new website that they're designing and they want us to be able to do that and go more towards um that kind of thing to help us as um customers and members and things just be able to get the information out there and not have to worry about all these like silly little like you're you're a big company why don't you got your shit straight kind of stuff <laughs> so they're cutting out cyber on monday right now and they're cutting out um black friday uh promotions and launches um so that they can focus on getting the server up to par because the server they have not updated and they should have a while ago so they're Hence why I say Mercury Retrograde's coming back around. All the stuff that should have been done before is coming back around for you guys, to, for everybody to look at and be like, oh, we should have did this before. Let's do this now. Let's not wait. Let's do it now. So there's a lot of that going on. So I'm excited. And of course, this year with the um, whole shutdown thing across the board, there's a lot of different 
things for shipping and stuff. So we've had a lot of bumps on the road, like everybody else has, um, and we're working through it. And I'm excited because um, this way I don't have to worry about missing out on something right away if I'm working or if I'm here trying to take care of Grant or something. So it actually does help me out too. And the cool thing is, um, I will share, share with you a little story a little bit later on another uh, video about um, beauty school and my um, new interesting uh, development with that. So um, I'm excited about that too. That that made me um, put trust back in people and company and really, really um, saying to my heart. And I'm going to pay it forward um, in the coming years for sure. All right, so um, I just wanted you guys to know that um, lavender essential oil, that's what I got. I actually, right now, I'm just going to put it on my blemishes because this is what we also call a Swiss Army knife of... I'm not going to put too much on because it's going to make me sleepy, but it's really good. I'm used to it, so I'm, I don't get sleepy that easily when I put this on now. Actually, I'll be learning more about lavender, too in my beauty class that I'm now going to be able to go to. Oh, I'm so excited. All because somebody was really nice and decided to gift me their ticket because of all the stuff I've been going through and not being able to visit things or go places. I have to do everything virtually and now I get the opportunity to. Oh, so beautiful. And I got actually the liquid foundation and all that stuff too, so I'm excited. Oh, now I'm diffuser. Oh, lovely. All right. I will uh, talk to you guys later. Um, by the way, just real quick, this is the quarterly one. We have a message from our founder, of course, in the front. This one's actually really big. And then we have uh, Better Gift Giving because they're not doing the holiday uh, catalog thing. Which I have to look up Nature Ultra to see if they're doing that other stuff. And then, of course, you've got um, in here the um, new updates. So you've got, like, um, articles. It's just like a regular article thing. Um, and then, of course, our founder's son just got married so that's really cool um so him and him is the girl um they're young but it's really cool a very beautiful dress um and then like the quarterly leadership one and then of course you got your your leaderships and everybody that ranked up and um they didn't do a food one this time but over here you've got, instead of the food area, you've got your um, DIY love on your um, self with like conditioner and do-yourself stuff. So I guess they ran out of DIY food, so now they're going to do DIY uh, makeup stuff. Um, and then like essentially gifts, you know, essentially yours, so it's really cute. And then like other things like product things and updates on what the company itself is doing, so that's really cool. So this one's actually more... Um, Talks about the five by five, by five like uh, sustainable products and uh, less waste and things like that in the foundation um, and things like that versus like before when it was all just kind of like, oh, this is a leader, you know, information from a leader person and, and, you know, stuff that wasn't really resonating with somebody that's just starting out necessarily, more or less somebody that's like kind of been in it, you know, and knows more about it. But anyway, and they had to actually cut down on the printing and all that stuff too so I think that's why it ended up becoming quarterly too instead of monthly so lots of different changes sometimes change is actually really good so I'm looking forward to the fact that they're focusing more on the website because I'm going to be able to get my own website because we had one before and it kind of didn't go so well so they're reformulating it and it's going to come out in um, 2021 hopefully January so then I'll be able to help you guys out and you'll be able to just click the link and then go on there and shop instead of doing the other um, which is awesome and um, some other stuff that's coming out so that's really cool and then I'll do my beauty school one in a little bit because um, that's gonna be virtual and I get a ticket thank you to so many people oh my god so many people love it all right but this is going on 20 minutes so I didn't want it to go this long but I'm sorry and sorry for being like all over the place there's been a lot of shit going on and a lot of other stuff with people I'm related to or not related to people I'm connected to that are having issues too and things um especially now with it being colder and um work issues issues here at the house a little bit not too bad but like different things with gramp going on readjusting the things like that and just uh doing another side hustle beyond this um with my nail street stuff um and just you know 
working it out day by day, trying to get by the best I can and doing what I can. So, all right, guys, love, light, and blessings. I will talk to you later. Thank you for uh, staying here 20 minutes in, and um, I got to go uh, feed Gramp and uh, feed myself and figure out what's going on because, um, yeah, I've been using my dragon time for the last two days, if you know what I mean. So I need to go put some more of that on as well and calm my emotions and my hormones down. And I will talk to you guys later. Stay safe, stay warm, and try to uh, stay as upbeat as you can. Because I know there's a lot of media out there and a lot of different things going on. Um, and I know it's kind of depressing sometimes. But uh, use your oils and uh, oil on everybody. Or um, do something fun. Something that brings you happiness and things. Um, like me, I do my crystals and my tie-dye and all my stuff. <laughs> Gets me going. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Love, light, and blessings, everybody. Namaste.